Now I'm going to share once again in relation to the team that we established for this month of May. Theme about having a blessing to know and understand the importance and the value of relationship. Relationship is what in the heart of God. Two days ago, I was at work holding this netbook. I was studying and someone came to me and said, what do you have? I said, it's a computer. Oh, it's a beautiful computer. And she started telling me about, she has a computer, but she's having a problem of doing this and doing a lot of things. And then when I asked questions, I found out that her computer is old. That her computer need to be upgraded. And I said, all that you need is either buy a new one or you have to upgrade your computer that you may do what you are telling me right now. And God spoke to me when I was talking to her because I believe that our relationship to God and to others, it has to be upgraded. Yes. Amen, yes. yes. It has to be upgraded that we may understand fully what's in the heart of God today. Hallelujah. Yes. I used to listen a cassette tape using this about 15 years ago I enjoyed this cassette hmm. wherever I go I listen to this cassette and then after a few years This came up. <laughs> There's an upgrading that's going on. Mm. Amen. Amen. When I heard this, I don't use this anymore. Mm. Because some people would make fun of you. Mm -hmm. Using the old thing when many people are using this. And guess what? After another year again, I have this iPhone. I, I, I an phone. iPad, iPad. Yeah. where you can store a lot of things. Amen, yes. And wherever I go, I love using this. I'm just trying to build up a good foundation of what I'm going to preach today. Mm, amen. Yes. I used to have this with all of this disket. Amen, yes. All of these are my teachings. I got a bunch of this. A bunch. I got all of these things here that I established 
as I started this church, all of those biscuits contains a lot of lessons, a lot of teachings. And guess what? All those teachings are in here. Hallelujah, yes. And ah. I can still put more here, even probably all of this in that room can get here. Because this is 32 gigs. Gigabytes. Can contain or can store a lot of things, isn't it? Amen, yes. My point of saying this, I truly believe that our relationship to God and to others has to be upgraded right now. Amen, yes. It has to be upgraded because God wants to use us powerfully. Yes, amen. Without any burden, I don't have to carry all of this because I have this. Hallelujah. Yes. Technologies can be bad, but technologies can help us to become a powerful servant of God. Amen, yes. There's a rich man from Texas who threw a big party for his daughter. And so he asked all the eligible bachelors he knew to attend. After the party had been going on for a while, he asked the men to step outside for an announcement. As he lined up, everyone alongside his Olympic high school, they were shocked to see that it was filled with poisonous water snakes and alligators. And he said, whoever would jump in and swim to the other side would have a choice of one million dollar. The second one, a thousand acres of choice property. And the third one, his daughter's hand in marriage. Suddenly there is a love plus. As one man swims across to the other end and emerges. The Texas host asked the young man if he wanted a million dollars in cars out of bread. The man says, no sir. So the Texan asked him if he wanted a thousand acres of choice land is still out of bread. And copying the man replies, no, thank you. Now the host smiled and said, so you want the hands of my daughter? <laughs> He's still catching his breath. The man said, no, sir. So the Texan asked him, what does he want? Is still out of bread, he says. All I want, sir, is to find out who pushed me. <laughs> <laughs> I want to know <laughs> with hatred so much trying to retaliate. He wants to know who is the responsible person <laughs> that pushed him. What I'm saying is this. Many people today 